Yes, we're going back out to the Wild West, and we're going to be trying out some sarsaparilla. He treat sarsaparilla. As I mentioned the other day, uh, Mike, when he came and played me a putt-putt, dropped me off a couple of cans of this eight treat And this is another eight treat taste test. And this time it's sarsaparilla. Now, sarsaparilla is made from a root, like root beer, so it's another type of root beer. And this was very popular, very popular down in the old West County, or in the old, or the old K Corral. They, was, they probably had some whole bunch of sarsaparilla hanging around. That's what let me tell you. Mm -mm. So you're going to go out West, and this is when you're going to try the sarsaparilla. See if this is mm, delightful or something to leave out for the dogs and the coyotes to take. And look at this, they even got a stagecoach on here. From the Wild West. Is this from the Wild West or is it from the Mild West? That's what we're gonna find out. Actually looks like the horses are going backwards. So we gotta go this way. So you see the horses going around the circles in the right way. Boom, 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 boom. Let's see how this A treat, sarsaparilla H, is it A treat or something that's Got to retreat. Really does taste like root beer. Really does taste like root beer. Just maybe a little more bite to it. Not bad, not bad at all. You know, even though it's like a name, like a treat or something like that, doesn't mean it's going to suck. I'm going to give this uh, a 6.8.